Yo, what's up, sexy Samlet Squad? The top comment was Fafnir, and you guys know I do not fuck with Guardians. So uh, we're playing the new Freya, the reworked Freya. Uh, a lot of people don't know, it kind of slid under the radar. Um, <clears throat> came out the same time as Jormungandr. But Freya got a rework, boys. So basically... Alright, relax, Freya. Jesus. Uh, I, you definitely don't need that many mana pots. To be honest, you don't you don't even need that many mana pots. So, the one is no longer time-based. As you can see, it's permanent. Well, it's not permanent, right? But you have five auto attacks, right? Um, Freya empowers her weapon, making her next five basic attacks. Deal bonus magical damage in an area around each enemy hit. Enemies hit by the explosion are slowed for 1.25 seconds. Minions take half damage from the explosion. Gods take 25% damage from any explosion after the first. So basically, it's a little mixture of a nerf and a buff, right? It does less damage instantly than old Freya's one. However, it does more damage over a period of the five autos. Also, if you miss, apparently it still takes the auto, which I was not aware, and uh, I had auto attack to test it, and it definitely does. <laughs> uh, worth noting, cooldown actually doesn't go up until you use all of the autos, so I'm going to go ahead and waste that last auto. I mean, okay. I don't really think it was very smart of him to waste his entire clear on me. But, um... To each their own. I'm gonna go ahead and get my mana back. I do have Banish. Um, yeah, his clear's not very good because he did waste it on me. Again, we gotta just come over here and punch this thing for some mana back. Well, okay. I, he crackened the buff, which, in my opinion, literally couldn't be stupider because... I win late game, so why would you throw your early game for a buff? But, you know, wh what do I know? He also didn't go to pick it up. Maybe I'm the dumbest human ever. Who actually knows? This does mean I'm going to lose his blue buff, like I won't be able to do his blue, but it also means that hopefully he will uh, he will lose that full wave. He has to he has to you know figure out if he wants that wave of XP or the blue buff. And it looks like he's going for the blue buff, which is super stupid, and I'm so happy about. So we'll go ahead and pick up this blue buff. I mean, we don't really need it to be honest with you because. We have infinite mana anyways. But, um... You know, whatever. blood basically he thought he was hot shit he thought he could do stuff he couldn't do and I called his bluff I said you know what big guy you know what big guy you can't do that I'm gonna stop you I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it down oh also I could have aged his alt but I decided to alt it 
I know I still take damage when I alt his alt. Is my alt isn't fast enough, believe it or not. Oops. Um But I felt like it was worth it because I needed the damage quicker than I needed to live, right? Like I if I got stunned then it would have been real not good. You know I go through minions with my auto attacks, right? <laughs> Or did you not know that? Because you know you're making literally no progress juking in a... If it, juking like this makes literally no progress. He's standing in the same spot not taking damage. So... Don't do that. For anyone anyone watching who's like, Wow, he juked a lot of autos. No, not really. He actually killed himself. Because he tried to juke that many autos in the same pattern. I expect him to surrender wholeheartedly in about three seconds, two seconds, one second, surrender. He didn't surrender. He'll surrender next kill. So how much damage does this do per explosion? About a hundred per explosion. There's five explosions. So if I hit all five autos, it does about 500 damage. Right? That's pretty crazy. Did he just ward? That is pretty crazy, but um, people like me, aka people who are bad at the game and can't hit auto attacks, it is a bit of a nerf, I will say. And honestly, it's a bit of a nerf just in general because of the, the damage is split out. Oh my god, she jumps so fucking high. Because the damage is split out between five autos rather than just one big ass explosion. Does it do extra damage to tower? It does not. Sorry. When can I get telekines? Another 200 gold. All right. Uh, I mean, I can't really do anything. So let's just go get telekines. <clears throat> alrighty, alrighty. Drop our blue buff. And we could honestly go do Bull Demon, but I want to get Tower down first. Come here, Stink Boy. Yeah, you, you see, you see the whole thing I'm talking about where it's a nerf for me because I can't hit auto attacks. That's uh, that's exactly, that's exactly what I meant. Okay, well. Okay, I don't know if that was the play you should have done, but um, it's definitely a play that happened. You should have just ran away, you know, like. I understand wanting to save your tower, but uh, if he ran away, I would have had no reason to stay, you know? Him staying gave me a reason to stay and take his tower. Okay, a red buff again. Can we do Fuego Gigante fast enough? Don't think so. Eh, maybe. I used to kill monsters like these back home. Oh, he he wasn't even gonna come. He was just like, you know what, dude, fuck it. Okay. Pretty much exactly what I expected. Um, if you guys... Actually, I want to see my TP. I want to see how close I am. Because... I have 1350, I think. 
First one of the day, GG. He's not even in the lobby, he left. Uh, not my adventurer's fault. I have 1350 and I was rank 18, now I'm rank 17. I have exactly 1350. How close am I to being kicked out? About 300 TP. Alright. I gotta get up like to here. Around 1900 TP to be safe. That's so absurd. That's so many TPs. If you guys enjoyed the video, uh, like, comment, subscribe. And make sure to check out the merch in the first link in the description. Or just scroll down and you can see the merch. Um, make sure to check out my Twitch stream at twitch.tv. I go live every day at 8 p.m. Excluding Sundays. And... Am I missing anything? Peace. Peace.